And how did you enjoy the Zian show just now? Uh, that was incredible. Yeah, yeah. Zian is, I think, one of the the new up and coming big stars for Canada. Good evening, we are backstage at Tom Men's Fashion Week. For uh, this collection, I found a lot of uh, inspirations from uh, my trip to Hong Kong. Uh -huh. And also, uh, like, a, well, like the rock and roll underground, like a punk, that's always been my like main inspiration. Okay. And also, like this time, I put uh, like some formal pieces, such as blazers and shirts together. Okay. Yeah, it's actually, uh, like, well, during the, well, like the whole three shows I did at Tom, this is the first season I have those pieces. So yeah, I'm very excited to uh, to have them walking down on the runway, and uh, it's actually from my line. <laughs> oh, amazing, yeah. amazing. We've just come out of the Xi'an Men's Fashion Show at Toronto Men's Fashion Week. And let me tell you, the show was super cool. I talked to quite a few people, and a, a few of them mentioned it was their favorite show so far. OK, good evening, guys. We're here with Jeff Ruscio, the founder of Tom. And how did you enjoy the Xi'an show just now? Uh, that was incredible, yeah. yeah. Xi'an is, I think, one of the, the new up-and-coming big stars for Canada. Yeah, amazing. Yeah, I really like the stars. They're really young and funky. For and sure, yeah. And you know what? It's also great because it's, you know, for fall, winter 2017, it's definitely like really reflective of like what young men and uh, really want to wear yeah. out there. Yeah. Any particular looks that really struck you that you enjoyed? I mean, you know what? I, I think all of the jackets and um, the um, is that like was that lamb's hair? Uh, oh like, right, like right, the black, right. The black blazer that was pretty fantastic as well. Right. Um, but I, I just love I, I love his aesthetic. I mean, I thought that the show was incredible. It was creativity, but it was subtle at the same time. I found the pieces classy. Like, I'm kind of disappointed that I don't have any of them already. And I know that it's a unisex line, so I'm actually excited to get my hands on some of it. Because it's got that edge, it's got that style, but it's still a little bit understated. And as you can tell, I love black. So uh, I'm all about it, absolutely. Exquisite, all the designs and such such a retro feel, and yeah. I, I really enjoyed the styles. Actually, it was very refreshing and, and very funky. I love yeah, it. Yeah, it was really cool, yeah. right? Any particular looks that really stood out to you tonight? Um, there was a few. They, they had one with the cowl neck. It was a very. I actually thought it was an all-in-one piece, and it was actually two pieces. Where I have a number of friends that have been looking heavily for that turtleneck that goes quite high, but it's actually a bit of a statement in, in lieu of a, of, a, of a scarf, and it was actually very much one of my favorites. I was saying to my wife, that's a great turtleneck, and as it was going by, which you highlighted very much, it was, it was actually two pieces which I hadn't seen before, so yeah, right when you think you've seen a doll, it was a very unique yeah. piece. Yeah, awesome. Congratulations again, it was Thank a really fantastic show. We all really enjoyed ourselves, and Thank good you. luck in the future. Thank you. Thank you.